What are the good and bad points about owning a scooter? Well, there's a few. Firstly, this is a unique scooter. It's not your standard scooter. And the reason for that is it's a 250cc Yamaha X City. What that actually means is it's quite rare in the UK. So what will end up happening is you will actually buy this and you'll discover that finding pieces, finding replacement parts is a little bit trickier than finding other parts. Firstly, I was struggling finding a number of pieces. So the last MOT, there was not a failure, there was an advisory and that advisory was the pass switch. So what did I do? I ordered a few options to replace it. So eBay is your friend. I ordered one and that did not work. It's basically the same issue. It's a sticky switch. So what did I do? I got another one. And that one, I actually took the individual switch out and replaced the individual switch as opposed to the whole unit. It's a little bit of a nightmare. However, luckily on eBay, I was able to find something to help me get it sorted. Would that have been an issue? It took a little bit more work. I did use a, a few different options to try and replace the old switch, as in trying to look at if it's rusted or corroded, and it wasn't, it was just sticky, and sticky in terms of it wouldn't lock into position. So that's the first thing that I had trouble with. A few other things that I did struggle with is, actually nothing else really. I've not had any problems. I've owned this for a long period of time. The battery has been an issue. Every couple of years the battery dies, but the last uh, fix that I did on the live stream actually worked. That was a good thing. I was able to fix the, the battery by topping it up and the shocks i looked at some shocks and that's quite a while ago one of them was actually cracked so i, I ordered replacement shocks and they were quite easy to buy because the measurements are transferable across multiple scooters overall it is actually it served me quite well to be honest with you i've been to london and back i've been to wales which weren't documented so in my future episodes there will be more documentation about the stuff i'm taking with me 250 cc's ideal amount of engine not too big not too small you know it's all you need and you get to a point where there will be some issues around if you get a bigger size motorcycle slash scooter the extra weight of the engine and the extra power kind of counteracts itself so for example a 125 you can easily get 50 60 miles per hour on this it's a 250 cc i could easily get 80 70 80 if i push it like ultimate i'll probably get 85 90 out of it and i think there's a little bit more there to give however for overtaking it's perfectly fine if you're overtaking other vehicles that are doing 40 miles per hour as long as you've got a good enough stretch it's okay to overtake um you know i i like it it needs a bit of a wash it's got a few uh it's more of a workhorse it just does what it needs to do it's got a top box it's got under seat storage i've serviced it myself tires are good overall positioning is good i'm five foot eight a big thing you'll note with these is uh, seating position if you're not that tall if you're not that tall it's like mm, let's just give me a let's give me, give me a quick ride demo while i'm here so first click every click starts uh one thing i did notice is one minute. Notice here, this is on en route with the of the scooter. It's got like nice, easy controls. You can use it correctly. And let me bring it back into picture, into frame. So I can duck behind the screen. It is a little bit loud, but with that, it does come great things. So you can see overall, you know, the, you know everything you need basically. Everything you need. It does everything well. I've done long journeys on it. Motorway is probably not excellent, but who wants to go on a motorway anyway? Easy to maneuver. Very easy to maneuver. So it's quite high, but uh, quite heavy, but it's low down. So in that example, it's, it's kind of good because all the weight is low down in this episode i'd like you to another video up here check that out that's going to be the start of the adventure and as i take the scooter around if you have a scooter can you take it far i think yes you can